done this in a long time. Um, I used to do YouTube all the time. Um, had a channel a long time ago. I'm old. Uh, been collecting for a very long time. And I used to do reviews, and it was a lot of fun, and then it became not fun, so I stopped. Um, but lately I've been wanting to get back into it. So, I figure, what's an easy way to ease myself back into doing reviews again? Sorry, stop. My cat is being a butthole. Um, what is an easy way to get back into doing this again? Stop! Get! <sighs> Obviously, nothing is easy, is it? Um, and I thought, how about an unboxing? That's easy. Just open shit and talk about it. So that's what I'm going to do. So first, we're doing some t-shirts because that's what I have. So, this first one, let's just, the pack. These always come this way. If anybody's ever bought any shirts from this company, you probably know what this is. Not what it is, but at least where it came from. They always have this colorful, like, wrapping. So, let's get in here. And I'm really been getting into these this company's shirts. There's something about the way they print them. Anyway. Oh. Ooh. New sticker. So. This is what we have. A nice new long sleeve Night of the Living Dead shirt. That's what the sleeves look like. Yes. I like it. Paul Bearer Press. This is their new sticker. They used to have one that just sort of looked like a coffin. I'm just gonna put that there. Next, I'm very excited about this one. This I pre-ordered. Oh, it looks good. Oh, and the bookmark they always send. So this one is Howling. It's a tie dye. They've just started doing tie dye cavity colors. Also, you gotta bear with me, guys. Th I haven't done this in a long time. Very much enjoy that. The other thing I was saying ooh, about is they always send you these bookmarks, and this is the one for this time. It's an Elvira bookmark. Who doesn't love Elvira? Okay. Now we'll get into some of what we really want to see, which is Blu-rays. I'm going to go down from the least excited to the most excited. So first, oh, packing peanuts. How I love, love, love packing peanuts. So first up is Massacre in Dinosaur Valley from Severn, um, which they still have slip covers. So, um, this one's an interesting one. It's, it's, it's almost like touted as a cannibal film. Uh, it's more of like a jungle adventure movie, more so than anything else. Um, but I quite enjoy it. Oh, there's just breasts all over that cover, isn't there? Well, okay. Oh, and they sent a nice little intervision sticker and Severn sticker. If you have seen or know anything about me, I love extras. So anytime I get a new sticker, I am a happy camper. Now let me clean up all these packing peanuts. Okay, next. Oh no, you're last. Next is from a little package from Grindhouse Video. Love me some Grindhouse Video. First, we have the 4K Blu-ray of 
Vigilante. Now I've been hearing a lot of really great things. This is the limited with the lenticular cover. I'm not big on the lenticular covers, but I figured why not? It's got a lot of new stuff on it too. Very cool. And this one, I don't know really why I bought it. I guess because it was limited, but it is the 4K Aero UHD trimmers. Um, I've seen this movie probably three million times. Uh, I love trimmers, but um, I wasn't sure that I wanted to own it. But I decided after watching a few videos that I would go ahead and pick it up. So. All right, and last but certainly not least is this bad boy. Oh, these are probably, yep. First, I'll just show these little guys. Oh yeah, some vinegar syndrome. I only have one in here, but I had to pick up some pins because I have been collecting pins. And here we go. VSA release of House of Usher. This is $27.95 out of $4,000. So, that. All right. And that's literally all I got this time. So, um,. We'll see what the response is. We'll see how much I like doing this. Um, you know, uh, eventually I would like to get back into doing reviews and collection updates and things like that. Um, but I figured for the first one, we'll give this little unboxing a try. See how video is and audio is and all that. So until next time, guys, see you later.